Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Peace and blessing be upon all of you Okay guys, so today we are going to show you how to install Epic Game Launcher and also Unreal Engine in Linux desktop and fine But before that, uh, just a quick look for just for those of you that doesn't know yet about uh, what is actually Unreal Engine So Unreal Engine is actually one of the most open and advanced real-time 3d creation tool so it's actually used a lot especially by gaming community and also um, a game developer but it's also kind of used a lot in architectural visualization so that actually you can render better in unreal engine and this is actually free you can install the unreal engine 5 and also unreal engine 4 it's up to you it depends on your spec of your computer if you have the latest uh, hardware it is better to use the unreal engine 5 because it gives you uh, the latest technology like lumen and also nanite and etc but if you, your computer is kind of kind of oldies so probably like um five years or seven years old and then you can use probably the Unreal Engine 4. So, but it's up to you. So, uh, before we start to install uh, this uh, Unreal Engine and also the launcher, because uh, the launcher is actually doesn't run well in Linux. So, actually, you can build the Linux build uh, by compiling it yourself, but it's kind of um, quite actually it takes a lot of time because last time i built my own uh it took me like 24 hours or something but this this uh this time i will not show you how to compile it but just to download the pre-built windows version because it runs very well with the launcher and the launcher is actually the one that we want because the launcher doesn't run in linux so we will use this Lutris. So for those of you that don't know yet about Lutris, Lutris is actually kind of uh, the extension of Wine. So this this is actually based on Wine, a fork of Wine, but it makes it better because uh, it supports like Proton and other stuff, DXVK. So it's and also like it's very easy, and you just click, click, and you do not need to write any um, like in Wine in our previous video uh, we use a lot of command right but with Lutris you do not need to do it you just click and it's very simple but um, before we start I'll show you my uh, setup so my computer is actually if I type new fetch here uh, so I'm using Linux Mint so it's actually um, Ubuntu this is Linux Mint 21 so this is actually Ubuntu 22 Jemmy Jellyfish and I'm using uh, the 16 gigabyte of memory or RAM and I'm using the Intel HD Graphics 530 which is actually an onboard PGA or onboard GPU not the dedicated one so this is integrated GPU okay um so to be to install that you need to go to this download section of Lutris and then find the Ubuntu one because we are using Ubuntu click this because uh, right now Lutris doesn't give us the the PPA so usually it used I used PPA to install Lutris but currently they do not give us the PPAs but they give us this uh, release through the github sign so you can install this is the latest one but normally i'll use this because this is the stable version um uh, 0 0.5.11 you can download this you just need to click it and then it's done so that that way but here i already downloaded it um and here is my download so the easiest way to do it is just by double clicking it because uh, in Linux Mint, it's easy and simple to install .dev because you just need to double click it and enter your password like this and then boom. You just need to wait until it's finished installing. 
okay it's already installed um just need to close it and then find in the menu and find lutris okay so this is the lutris it just takes time uh, to uh, to set up things because it needs to download some things so you just need to be patient because it depends on your computer uh, your internet uh, speed I mean So for the first time, this is the window of uh, Lutris. So what you can do is actually just click this Add Game Plus and then search the Lutris website for installer and then type this Epic Epic Game Mate. Yep, this one's Epic Game Store. So we want to install this. Uh, you can use the Wine standard. Okay, just press install and then it will ask you to locate the file so here uh, we we will install this in a home folder and then games and epic game store but I don't want this so I will use this instead with a, a folder games such as um, from home and then epic games okay install and then it will download some stuff so you just need to wait it's finished basically. And then um it will ask you to install this and then you can just press download download okay all right and then continue and then they will download it okay let it finish it will uh, install itself Just need to be patient and then you just need to click 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 to click some stuff and then go down see it installed its own dependencies it runs wine tricks in the background so you do not need to type yourself Okay, installation completed. Launch. Okay, so now it will download the update of the Epic Games. We just need to be patient, just wait till it's finished. Okay, now it's opening up the launcher so this is the epic games launcher but you need to sign in uh, to your account you can use you if you have the epic games account you can click here but uh, you can also use the Google. You will get redirected to the to your account.
Okay, now we can go back to our Epic Launcher. Okay, so this means that you have installed correctly the Epic Game Launcher. And then uh, for installing this, uh, we need to install the library. And this is the one that we want to install, the Unreal. So here, uh, we can install a marketplace, we can download the samples here. Okay, so Epic Online Services was installed correctly, good. Okay, so this is a... Uh, the library for Unreal Engine. So what we need to do next is actually we need to install the engine. So to install the engine, if you click that button, you will automatically install the latest version of the engine, which is actually uh, the Unreal Engine 5.0.3. This is the latest one. But just in case, if you want to install uh, the older version of Unreal Engine, which is actually Unreal Engine 4, because your computer is older, like mine, so what you can do is you can press this plus button here, and then you will automatically install the latest version of uh, version Unreal Engine 4, which is 4.27.2. In this state and then you can click this remove slot to uninstall it and then you can press this install and just follow it and then install and then you will, we will need to download some stuff here and then you just need to wait until it's finished downloading so it will inst it will download like 13.6 gigabyte data Okay guys, once it's finished like this, uh, you can just launch uh, the engine by clicking launch and then it will launch. Okay guys, so that is how you install Lutris, Epic Game Launcher and Unreal Engine in Linux. Hope that helps. Don't forget to subscribe and like and comment and also share if you like the video. Okay, I hope that's helpful. Thanks very much. See you soon and wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Peace and blessing be upon all of you. Bye bye.